All right, welcome to my January 21st live item shop review video. If you're an NFL fan, then you saw the Lions won today. We are one game away from the Super Bowl. Can you believe that? As a lifelong Lions fan, I am absolutely in heaven. But now we got to beat the 49ers, which is no easy task. And if you're a Bills fan, holy smokes, uh, the Chiefs are killing me. They're too good. Even when their team isn't even that good, they're still winning. Are you kidding me? So as for this item shop, it looks like a lot of things got removed. This is a very small shop with all things considered. What do we got? The Galaxy Pack has returned. This is the one that does not include a wrap. This was what, the second ever Galaxy skin we had? I can't remember if this came out before or after the Crew Pack one. But aside from the Crew, this is definitely the second one we ever had. First one in the item shop. Grit is back with Sunflower Skull Trooper. Kind of weird to see him here, but there he is. Of course, he's got multiple styles. The only one I don't have is purple, unfortunately. Punched up his back for 200, and then the ground pound for 200. Nothing really special with either of those. This whole section is returning. Ravage, Scarlet Commander, Adventure Peely, Crisscross, and Breaking. These were all here yesterday, if I remember correctly. Down here, we've got some new ones. Double Cross is back. She's a solid skin. Let's see what her Lego version looks like. Uh, I don't know about that. Where's her eye patch? What's going on here? She has an eye patch for both styles, yet not for Lego. That doesn't even look like her. Come on. Velocity makes a return. She clearly is not finished in Lego terms. Cloak Star, he's kind of rare. That's a solid skin. You don't see many people run. How about his Lego skin? I don't know if that's finished. I can't tell. Now look at this, Redux is back. A lot of people speculate that this is Midas's weird brother. I mean, he does kind of look like Midas. He just, I don't know, that hairdo. Let's see what his Lego skin looks like. <laughs> well, that doesn't look like him either. They could have at least put the glasses on. So this one's been gone, I think, almost a year, maybe even more than a year. And remember, he is secretly reactive when you aim down sights. I think a little laser pops up from his hands. I can't remember. Something pops up when you aim down sights. And then the Bionic Synapse goes with him as well. That's a pretty solid pickaxe. So Cloak Star and Redux are definitely the rarest things in the shop. If you missed out on Summit Seeker Eevee, she is still here, thankfully. A lot of people were freaking out and thinking she would go away after one day. No, at least not yet. I did do a full gameplay review on her if you want to check that out. We got the full tilt emote. That's a fun one. Traversal. Living large. Not a fan of this one myself, but I know a lot of people love it. And the Deep Thunder. So this is an instrument, so you can't really do much with it. Color scheme looks great, though. I mean, that goes perfectly with Summit Seeker Eevee because, of course, it is in her set. But I still think these are overpriced. A thousand V-Bucks. Yeah, it looks cool, but like I said, you can't do much with it at the moment. If we could run these as pickaxes, I think a lot of people would buy them. And the My Hero Academia stuff still here. All of it, plus the Terminator bundle still sticking around. Diesel. Cyclone, Weekend, all the jam tracks, and the gear for festival. So, like I said, a smaller shop. And the highlight is that Redux, aka Midas's brother, maybe? And Cloak Star back, and then Summit Seeker Eevee is still here. Plus her new bass guitar. There you go. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is Tabor Time.